Welcome to the Droid Guide channel. This video will show you how to enable and set up voicemail on the Galaxy Note 20. Keep watching if you need help activating your new notes built-in voicemail feature through the phone app settings. Missing phone calls is inevitable among those who have hectic schedules. Thankfully modern smartphones are already offering handy solutions to make people listen to unanswered phone calls. This is made possible with voicemail. Voicemail refers to a recorded audio or voice message from unanswered phone calls. These recordings are stored in a mailbox on your service provider's server just like how email messages are stored. In order to start listening to voicemail recordings, the feature must be activated on your phone beforehand. If you're wondering how to activate and set up this feature on your new Note device, I've outlined a step-by-step -step walkthrough for you to follow. And here's how it's done. To get started, tap the phone app icon from the home screen. It's usually lined up among other default icons at the bottom of the home screen. The phone app icon can also be accessed through the app's viewer. Either way will route you to the same phone app screen. While on the phone app main screen, tap the quick menu icon represented by a triple dot figure located on the upper right most corner of the screen. A pop-up menu will launch with the phone app features and relevant information. tap settings to continue. The phone app settings or call settings menu will load up on the next display. Listed on this menu are basically the phone's smart call features. Scroll down and then tap voicemail to proceed. The voicemail menu then opens. Here you can access the voicemail settings and manage voicemail notifications. Select voicemail settings to access and manage the default voicemail configuration on your device. Another menu opens with voicemail number. If you haven't set it up yet, the status will say not set. To set it up simply tap on voicemail number, a pop-up window will prompt you to enter the voicemail number. You can manually type the number into the provided text field or tap the contacts icon to select the number from your contacts list. If you up the ladder, simply tap on the icon and then select the preferred phone number from the contacts list. Tap done on the soft keypad and then tap OK to confirm. When the recent changes are saved you will get a pop-up message that states the voicemail number changed. Simply tap OK to close the pop-up. You then should see that the selected number will appear beneath the voicemail number. To manage voicemail notifications, tap the back key to return to the previous menu and then tap notifications. On the notifications menu, configure the settings according to your own preferences. Simply tap to choose the voicemail notification settings that you want to alter then follow the rest of the on-screen instructions to make and apply new changes. And that's it please support our channel by clicking like, share, subscribe and hit the notification bell for more troubleshooting videos. Thanks for watching.